Hello everyone, this is Imran Emu and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video training, I'm just going to show you how to design the default drop down attributes of WooCommerce variable product to like this using WooCommerce variation sources plugin. Okay, uh, here I'm on the dashboard of my website and from the plugins menu, I'm just going to click on add new and upload plugin choose file here is the plugin file here goes the plugin file and hit install hit activate plugin okay the plugin has been activated now i'm just going to show you how to create this attributes color and size from the products menu i'm just going to navigate to attributes and hit this attribute menu here i will just add new attributes the first attribute will be color and you can see the type i will select color you can see this type option because we installed the plugin okay if you don't install the plugin you won't see this option okay hit attribute and here you can see the type is color and slug is color and come here on this configure terms section and add some values okay i'm just going to add some colors here and get the color value name of the color green add new color here it is and blue okay here goes this attribute values let's create another attribute that will be size and type is button and head it okay let's configure the terms and add new size s for a small and m for medium for large okay now I'm just going to create a product like this from this product section I'm just going to click on add new I'm going to name it okay here put some dummy description okay from the product data you will select variable product okay and you can see attributes here and we will add attribute color add check this box just used for variations and select all okay again we will add size add here use for variations select all and hit save attributes okay now come here on variation section we will add variations from all attributes and hit go just click on ok click on ok ok here goes all the options i'm just going to quickly 
configure this from the bottom add images like this and price please don't forget to add the price and well now add image for green medium just this one and set the regular price 12 and green large select image price Well, I have added the required images and set the regular prices all the for all the variations. Now I'm just going to hit this save changes button. I'm just going to set is at clothing category and add an image. This one for featured image and finally hit publish and just view the product now you can see nice color sources and button okay if i uninstall the plugin whatever just from the plugin section this plugin now reload this product and now you can see the native select option of WooCommerce so if you want nice color sources you can install this plugin I have provided the link of this play I have provided the link of this plugin in the video description. I'm just going to hit activate again. Okay. Again reload this page. Here it is. Now you can just work with the settings. Simple setting. You can get round shape of these things uh, like it changes reload again okay and advanced option you can just work with these things for images you can change the value of width height and font size okay so hope you liked this work and you could complete this following this video please don't forget to like the video and share it and subscribe to the channel